everyone, and welcome to today's online lesson uh, for beginning trombone players. My name is Sean Bell, your instructor for today. Today we're going to talk about using the mouthpiece and how we mouthpiece buzz um, in order to get our instrument working. To start with, I want to review just one exercise from our last lesson. We used a pencil in our last lesson to set up our embouchure in the right way. That's going to be really important when we go to our mouthpiece. So let's check that exercise out. Remember, we start by saying ah to an mmm, forming our lips around that pencil eraser. Um, and then we blow our air through that opening that is created. Now we're going to do the same thing on our mouthpiece here um, to create the buzz. You're going to set up that embouchure, um, that feeling you had around the pencil eraser, and you're going to blow your air. Let's see what note comes out. Now whatever note came out of your mouthpiece, that's not so important right now. We just want a nice steady sound that is relatively focused. It might have a little bit of air in the sound, that's okay. Let's try to start at a note and buzz a little bit lower. Now you heard I slid down to the next note. That is really what we're looking for here. Let's try going the other direction, sliding up a little higher. Now let's see if we can start in the middle, go up and come back down. Great. Now the only thing that's important here is that we're keeping a consistent buzz and that we're getting that nice sliding between each note. That is the most important thing to do on the mouthpiece. Okay, now we're going to go to the horn. Really think about some of the grip stuff that we talked about um, a couple lessons ago. And we're going to play all in first position today. So with your slide all the way in, I want you to take a big breath and try to buzz the same way that we did when we were on our mouthpiece. Whatever note comes out is all good for me. It's probably gonna be an F in the staff or maybe a low B flat in the staff. So for me, that was an F. Now we're gonna play that a couple times and just play nice long notes. We're gonna breathe, we're gonna play for four counts, and then we're gonna rest for four counts. We're gonna do that three times. One, two, three. Two, three. Two, three. Okay, so that is my F in the staff. Now the question is, well, what if a B flat came out for me a little bit easier? Let's try that low B flat and then talk about how we get between those two notes. Here is your low B flat. One, two, three. Two, three. Two, three. Those are probably our two notes that most trombone players are going to start on. If we want to go between those two notes, we want to think that in the lower register, our air is moving through a little wider opening and it's moving a little bit slower. And as we get higher, it's moving a little faster. That opening tends to be a little more focused. However, the more important thing is we want to listen to where those notes are. The changes that you make with your embouchure are very, very small. And so you really have to hear where those notes are going. We want to hear in our head. And so on and so forth. So that gets us going on our first couple notes on the instrument, our first sounds. Um, we've really got to get good command over the air, the buzzing, and those first couple notes before we move on to figuring out all the slide positions and stuff like that. So we'll talk about those in the next couple lessons.